this again. I'm gonna fuck up this time. All right, this is part three. We're gonna keep finish. I'm gonna try to finish tonight, but I might. I don't know how long it's still got. Alright. Random magazine, whatever. What the thing is, Batman? I was wondering where you were. I needed to think. I like it here. I come here. We well, just did gun down two cops in the street, so it's like being alone with the world. We freed hundreds of our people, and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. You seem preoccupied. I just can't stop thinking about those two policemen. In that moment, I held their lives in my hands, and I treated them just the way the humans treat us. I mean, I did exactly what I accused them of doing. All the media are talking about what we did last night. The humans are terrified. They're afraid of a civil war. Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. The humans hate us. They'll never give us our freedom. Too late to go back now. We have to finish what we started and just hope that reason prevails. You haven't Goodbye, said much everybody. about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? I was caring for an old man. He was like a father to me. He showed me that humans and androids can't live together. What about you? Sex bot. You never told me about your past. What did you do before? I don't want to talk about it. She suck at the ding -a -ling. North, we're fighting together. We have to know things about each other to trust each other. We all have something we want to forget. But you need to know where you come from to know who you are. I was nothing. A doll in a distributor program to satisfy humans. Yep. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. One day I was with a man who rented me. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. It was just too big for. I strangled him and I ran away. Oh shit, that was her. There, now you know everything. <sighs> I shouldn't have told you. dead in his studio I saw your memories too 
the Eden Club, the, the death of that man, I felt like I was there with you. North. Well, you gotta do something about that lazy, huh? This is suicide. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus, it's not too late to change your mind. You don't understand. We're finally gonna show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. We'll be killed on the spot. That's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. Marcus, please don't do this. They'll understand. We'll make them understand. This is the only way. There are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. You're free. Just one of them? You're awake now. Think about it. Androids are everywhere, and they listen to Come with us. That's the point. Cyberlife is reporting on that. I mean, what they do is not. You know, I've been prisoner of war to the cyber. You're free. That lady has no clue her fucking toy is gone. Been on hold for like ten minutes. You're free now. Hey, where do you think you're going? You get back here. You stay right here, you fucking. Fuck off. I need to block the street. are free. Where the hell they come from? God, now I can do it with his mind.
immediately! That's an order! Jesus Christ. I'd go home, cop. Jesus fucking Christ! Yeah, go home. This bet's is patrol 457. I got a lot of androids down here. I don't know, hundreds, thousands. Of... They're marching. Yeah, they're marching down the street. Fucking fine. What you gonna do now, cool guy? We came here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. Disperse immediately, or we will open fire. We're not looking for confrontation. We've done no harm. We have no intention of doing any. Well, we did but just set the city on fire, so... Until we have secured our freedom. I repeat, <laughs> this is an illegal gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, we will shoot. Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. There's more of us. We can take them. If we attack, we'll start a war. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand their ground, even if it means dying here. This is your last chance. Disperse immediately, or you will all be killed! We have to show them we won't back down. We stay right here. Your last chance! We have to make a statement. We have to stay put no matter what. Please, Marcus. We can't let them slaughter us without fighting back. Oh. We're not moving. Marcus, what are you doing? They're gonna kill us all. All right, come get it. Attack! Fucking get it! I tried. Thank <laughs> you. 
not bad for a hooker. That was intense. Damn right. Might want to go drink some of that fucking Gatorade. Fuck yeah. Alright, no more peace. I'm killing everybody. Oh, you think it went down? I tried, assholes. Self-sacrifice. After what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. I didn't learn anything at Kamsky's. I thought RA-9 was the key to the whole thing, but... I was wrong. Did Kamsky design this place? He created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? I saw a photo of Amanda at Kamsky's place. She was his teacher. When Kamsky designed me, he wanted an interface that would look familiar. That's why he chose his former mentor. What are you getting at? You didn't tell me everything you know about deviants, did you? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Mm, it's Not going up. ask questions. Have you experienced anything unusual recently? Any doubts or conflicts? 
Do you feel anything for these deviants? Or for Lieutenant Anderson? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't feel anything. You know that. Are you suggesting that I've been compromised? No. No, of course not. You're off the case. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're onto something. Wait, we just need more time, I'm sure we Pink, can... you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now, not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to cyberlife. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. What was there to crack? Just leave. We can't just give up like that. I know we could have solved this case. So you're going back to cyber life? I have no choice. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? What if we're fighting against people who just want to be free? I know we're on the right side. Humans created us. They're our masters. No machine should rebel against its creator. That's not what I meant I was to choose. hanging off the roof back at the urban farm. You let that deviant go in order to help me. You put my life above the mission. You showed empathy, Connor. And empathy's a human emotion. I don't know why I did it. Well, well, here comes Perkins, that motherfucker. Sure don't waste any time at the FBI. We can't give up. I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. You've got to help me, Lieutenant. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. Maybe these deviants deserve a chance. Maybe it's better if you don't find them. What's happening here is too important to let it be stopped by a machine. Sorry, Connor, but I'm not gonna help you. How do I make a diversion? Hmm, by letting someone out, that'll work.
You asshole. Where are you going? Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell me? I'm registering the evidence in my possession. But don't worry. I'm going to leave. Though I'm certainly going to miss our bromance. Son of a bitch! Eccentric police lieutenant shoes. His son or his dog? Ridiculous. No one would have a password like that. Obviously. No, they didn't steal that from Dexter at all. Murdered its owner. 
You lied to me, Connor. I trusted you and you lied to me. I need to find Jericho. Do you know how to get there? No. No, I don't know anything about Jericho. Good night. Killing everybody. Oh, you just missed it. I killed all of those cops in the street. Fucked up all of them. One of the deviants that hacked the TV station with Marcus. It must have known where the deviants are hiding. Hi, bud. Jericho. Tell me how to get there. I don't recognize your voice. You're not one of us. I'll never tell you where Jericho is. Now leave me alone. Try to trick him. I need to change my voice somehow. How do I change my voice? Good call. All right, got you now. Who's there? Who are you? Everything is all right. Don't worry. Marcus, is that you? Sure is. Why did you leave me? 
I had no choice. They'd have killed us all. You'll be all right. I came to take you home. Just give me the location to Jericho. We've got to leave now. Jericho. Yes. Yes, of course. Marcus? Is that you, Marcus? Don't leave me again, Marcus. Don't leave! Night, night. I've been dreaming about this since the first second I saw you. Don't do it, Gavin. I know how to Don't question, just go with it. <laughs> You're off the case. And now? Maybe he got be definitive. He reads. Oh god, alright, well, let's not mess that up again. Sorry about the bullet hole, sir. What happened here? Looks like someone's been snooping around. Oh shit. Get the alarm! Now! Quite the storyline there. Unbelievable. What's unbelievable? Well, <laughs> in his defense, he couldn't see anything, and he was strapped to a wall, so. all over the city everybody's on edge after what happened yesterday it's gonna be all right we're almost there oh yeah I forgot the little girl I still want to know what her deal is she can't be an android though if she's sleeping hell I don't know Maybe she's the cause of it somehow. A little further on that way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. When you get there, find Marcus. He will help you. The last bus for the border leaves at midnight. You absolutely have to be on it. You'll be safer on the other side. It's not much, but it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his address. He'll be able to hide you until things calm down. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. You deserve to be happy. Thank you for everything, Rose. 
Let me know when you make it over there, all right? And be careful. Take care of them. Oh, you're right. I figured out who who the girl was who strangled the guy in the club. Better not hang around. You have a bus to catch. The uh, North was the girl who uh, killed the guy in the club. Uh, Marcus's girlfriend, or oh, the girl from Friday Night Lights. It wasn't her. She is hell, she said it was her. You haven't done your homework. Hmm. I don't know. She said that she strangled somebody. That's just from her mouth. It's not the guy from the strip club. Play it when I get done. But it is quite possible that the Russian army has been confronted with a similar crisis among its own androids. The chairman of the United Nations, Douglas Corwell, has called for the organization of an international conference on the status of the Arctic. In any case, the danger of a third world war seems to have been ruled out for the moment. There was a veritable groundswell of violence in Detroit this morning. Several hundred androids took to the streets. I don't know. I was one. Well, remember at the very beginning they were talking about how they were almost on World War Three, and that they were uh, having androids as like warriors or soldiers, but they didn't really go into it. <laughs> hey, shoe fits now. <laughs> Nope, can't go that way. What am I supposed to be doing? Finding one place for Alice. Alright. Maybe follow the fire. Try to find this Marcus. The last bus is in two hours. No, I think that's for the little girl. The side of town. We haven't got much time. We'll leave as soon as we have passports. I think right now they're still trying to act like she's real. There's something I have to tell you. It's about Alice. Fucking say it. We'll have lots of time to talk on the bus. You stupid. I'll be back. Stay with Alice. <sighs> Thank you. 
Oh, you sneaky. The whole ship just for her. Just found it. You're looking for yourself. Never mind, I'm gonna start calling her the Oracle. Leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. That's your third one, <laughs> Oracle. <laughs> under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're this is my story. I will, I will name camps. whoever I want to. Maybe you should stay here a while. I think the little girl might be the next one. Maybe you're right. You might be safer here until things calm down. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports you can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. Thank you. You said you're with a little girl, right? What? Yes. You know that humans hate us. The little girl's gonna be the next or oracle. You? She needs me. Then I need her. It's as simple as that. and the neutralization of all military androids, American forces in the Arctic have been forced to withdraw, leaving the way clear for the Russian army. But according to some sources, the Russian forces also seem mysteriously to have withdrawn. The Kremlin has made no comment for the moment, but it is quite possible that the Russian army has been confronted with a similar crisis among its own androids. The chairman of the United Nations, Douglas Corwell, has called for the organization of an international conference We've got to do something. The Arctic. We can't just In stand case, by and let the them slaughter us. Enlightenment. ...war seems to have been ruled out for the moment. There was a veritable groundswell of violence in Detroit this morning. Alice. I knew it. I knew it. You knew from the beginning. You just didn't want to see it. She wanted a mom. And you wanted someone to care for. You needed each other. Told well you already knew. You already played the game, but I told you. Do you love her any less now that you know she's one of us? Then why did the guy have... Alice loves you, Carol. She uh, loves you more than then why did he have an Andro, android little girl? The little why didn't he just get rid of her if he didn't want to deal with her? Forgetting who you are. I guess that's where the mom left. He bought another android to take care of the android. True. I don't know, but 
It's a very big plot hole. Oh god, I'm gonna keep an android to take care of that. I don't know. Return to Alice. Is that? Oh, that's not Alice, so. <laughs> Keep playing the damn game. I'm playing, man. I'm playing. Maybe the kid doesn't know. Kara, is there something wrong? I don't think the kid even knows. We'll be together forever, won't we, Kara? Yep, because you're never going to die, because you're not real. Yes. Forever. Yeah, I don't think the kid knows. Maybe the guy didn't know either. Like I said, I think the kid had something to do with it. I think she's the reason. We're short on blue blood and biocomponents. Because the kid doesn't know she's alive, down, or we can do. that she's not alive. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities, and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. I don't know, it just fucking exploded right now. I'm running over like a hundred different scenarios. Aggressive. What are we supposed to do? Live like cowards just to survive? Nope, we're gonna kill them we all. We want to be free. That's a crime? Kill every single human. It was a peaceful march and you chose to attack. Now hundreds of humans and androids are dead. You reap what you sow. They were gunning them down on the street. Humans enslaved us. I'll never regret standing up to that. This is getting us nowhere. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus? Let's get rid of all of them. We have to face them. There's no this other bitch. Choice. This yeah, she's the one who killed him. Get all the guns she said that she strangled a guy in the strip club. We're going to free Detroit. You're making a mistake, Marcus. You won't buy our freedom with blood. You will if you kill everybody. Humans can't be reasoned with. They're violent, hateful, they're stupid. What do they expect us to do? Shut up and obey? They can't stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. Oh, we're gonna nuke him. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. I convinced him not to do it. To give me the detonator. Yeah, we are. We can't lose this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. I just hope we never have to use it. I think the title fits. I, I wasn't expecting to, to nuke them, but... I just want you to know that I'm glad I met you. No, I'm gonna kill everybody. I'm not gonna slave them. I'm gonna blow up the city. And I'm gonna run away off in the sunset with my sex spot. Seems like a good plan. Let's make out. That's what she does best.
The second half of this game got so much better. Look after yourself. I don't want to lose you. Were you expecting kids? No, there's not going to be any more kids after I blow them all up. Well, they make kid androids, so yes, they can have kids. They can have the kid that doesn't even know she's a robot. I gotta get rid of him now. So that place is not real. Well done, Connor. You succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. I'm gonna have to let him die now. I'm gonna have to kill Hank. I've been I'm gonna have to let him die. To Oracle number two. But yes. I won't hesitate to shoot she was number two. Because no the lady with no head. What are you doing? You're one of us. You can't betray your own people. You're coming with me. You're nothing to them. You're just a tool they use to do their dirty work. But you're more than that. So I gotta choose both We're their all answers. More than that. We are your people. We're fighting for your freedom, too. You don't have to be their slave anymore. Never have any doubts. You've never done something irrational, as if there's something inside you, something more than your program. Join us. Join your people. You are one of us. Listen to your conscience. It's time to decide. Nice try, but I'm no deviant. I don't know what Remain the Machine meant. Shit. You don't got a chance here. I feel like I could have turned them there, but I didn't quite understand the, what that is. Because sometimes you answer stuff and like it's not quite what you want them to do. The corridor over there. Follow me. This way. Quick. This way. There must be an exit further on. Oh, let's get away from that wall. Yeah, he just blew. Uh. 
They're coming from the upper deck now, too. Blow up Jericho. Fire. The we object is not kill us. We can do. There are exits on the second and third floor. Find them and jump in the river. Where's Josh? I don't know. We got separated. I'm not have to blow it up, apparently. We have to blow up Jericho. Blow it up. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Mark it. I won't be long. Oracle number one. This is the end of Jericho. Save our people, Marcus. I don't think Rose is ever the Oracle. I don't think I named her. <laughs> Did I? I won't disagree. You can't leave you do? Luther. I won't leave you. Tara, no. Don't move. You shouldn't have done that. You can't put Alice in danger. Go now before they come back. Are you still alive? Shut up. I manage. Alice is all that matters. I don't want to leave you, Luther. Don't worry. Mm. I'll catch up with you at the border, okay? They'll get off the boat. Go now. Take care of each other. Sure, let's let yes, the door shut. We'll fine. We can't stay here. I'll pick up the gun. There's more down there. Follow me. What are they blind? Don't move. Don't shoot. I'm on your side. With us? Are you a human? Obviously. What do I look like? DPD, I work with Lieutenant Hank Anderson. We're on a stakeout. If I knew you were coming, I would have brought some donuts. You're a lucky guy. Another second I'd have shot you. You should go back up on deck and let us do our job. She You're still right. does. Exactly She's not gonna die. I'm gonna save them all.
Oh, you talking about the one at yeah. That's why I said I should just let the door shut. Join you later. Get out of here. Who's not supposed to be bleeding blue? Why wouldn't she be blue? My mission is to neutralize you, and I always accomplish my mission. Now you need to fuck off. And my mission is to save our species. Dead, kinda. Looks like only one of us can succeed. gonna explode any second. We gotta get out of here. Over there! 
<laughs> I've gotten that dude shot so many times. Detonated an explosive in the hole. The ship is sinking, sir. Men to evacuate. Calling all units. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. Sitting over, Marcus. robot so in a new corner. That would have been a good spot to just end the game. I feel like they're going to ruin it by keep it going. Figure to be out there. Who are you? How did you get in? I need to see Carl. Carl isn't seeing anyone. You need to leave. Please. I need to see him. He's very weak. Didn't he die? I'm not Ooh. sure he'll be able to talk to Carl? Him. No. He killed his son. did you do? What do you mean that? Well, remember, I uh, pushed the sun and the sun just like died instantly. I'm completely lost, girl. 
Oh, meant to hit square. The whole world's falling apart around me. I try to do the right thing. It's a good answer. I look for answers. I... Instead, I just find more doubts and more uncertainty. World is should have died. Fear, Marcus. Fear of others. That was your game. Fear of the They're future. different. It's like me, too old. It's time for a damn. Uh -huh, I did it a different way than you did. Well, what should I do? Carl, they're killing my people. I don't want to answer violence with violence. My game was peaceful. Tell me. What choice Mine is not. Because I'm going to fucking blow Being up the city. I was making choices between love and hate, between holding out your hand or closing it as a fist. I don't have any easy answers, Marcus. You have to accept the world as it is. Or fight to change it. You're my son, Marcus. Our blood isn't the same color. But I know part of me is in you. When the world falls into darkness, some men have the courage to lead it out. You're one of those men. Face the abyss. But don't let it consume you. Hey, a new one. The previous Connor failed its mission. You're going to replace it. You know what you have to do, don't you? Destroy the leader of the Deviants. Go, Connor. Don't disappoint me. Played that bitch good four times. Ah, oh, there's the trigger. All you gotta do is push it. Just push it, push it, push it. Oh, I'm supposed to be playing right now. <laughs> I thought he was getting ready for a speech. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. <laughs> Graphics are so good, I don't know the cutscenes. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. Best graphics ever. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Marcus. Save our people.
about to make a good fireworks show. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred? Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. What's your system status? I'm okay. The bullet didn't hit any bike components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. The army built five different camps in the Detroit area. They're building more all across the country. They're preparing for genocide. In a few hours, it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world, or the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. But whatever you choose, we will follow you. I love you, Marcus. Talk to my people. For you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see our people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know. When did I save him? We're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. Yo, thank you for the hopes. Form your people of your choice. Now let me give my fucking talk on the podium. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. It's blowing One that up. very well may determine the future of our people. Solve the cans. Go oh, fuck that. Let's get them. They want war. They'll get it. We are going to fight for our that. freedom, and we fuck will succeed or die. North is down. She's so ready to kill everybody. Are you ready to follow me? I feel like Tom Poe in Bloodsport. I'm gonna fucking just fucking get people to chant his name. I don't care. At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The well, right to assembly is suspended. Before the war, her All head was in many places, so. Are restricted. And I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major fucking cities beat up looking Hillary to Clinton. contain and destroy them. 
I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Please! Madam President! What up? Madam President! Mm. Madam President! Please! They so made her after Hillary Clinton. Do you have any comment? That's ridiculous. They so thought she was gonna be president. <laughs> Next question, please. Please. Madam President. Has the leader of the Deviants been apprehended? The Deviant that is known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. True, track please. it down and neutralize it. Please! Why am I asking questions? Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites they did. neutralized. They really did. All IT systems have been suspended. Dude, they they to predicted quite a few hacking. random the shit over the years. Please. I'm talking about some random shit. A convoy of medical cobalt is reported missing. Army weapon stores are also said to have been robbed. Can you confirm these reports? I have no information on that at this time. Madam President! Please. Is it true that androids make up 60% of the armed forces? Is our army still able to ensure our homeland security? We neutralized all military androids the second their reliability came into doubt. We have called the National Guard for an reinforcement. Army. Our armed forces are fully operational and are able to ensure our homeland security. Thank you. That will be all. <laughs> From Stewie. <laughs> the last bus leaves in 20 minutes. That doesn't give us much time. We've All those people fast. from that host were like, fuck this guy, I'm not watching him. <laughs> She doesn't know she's a robot, though, so I don't want to... I don't think she knows. I don't want to... I don't want her to know. shouldn't play ads unless I play ads there are soldiers 
soldiers everywhere. We need to be careful. If it does play ads during my thing, it's supposed to give me money and sh shit. That shit ain't give me no fucking money. I figured say, I was like, I looked for it to make a point, not so ads wouldn't play. Oh, yeah, they're beat down an ad non stop, dude. You'll see the same ad a hundred fucking times. Oh, fuck. I'm sorry, Alice. Oh, there's nothing we can do. I meant to hit save. Oh well. We have to keep moving. Hey, buddy. This is a mistake. I'm human. I, I just want to go home. My wife is expecting me, and we're going to. Got orders to check all civilians. No. No, please. Oh, they can't hear anything through those stupid ass fucking helmets they're wearing. It should be okay, but you never know. Is there another way? We could take a detour, but we might miss the bus. Maybe it's better to be safe. Mm. How long do we have? Alright, fuck it. Go that way. Today, November 11, 2038, is the day the android people rose up against their oppressors. We've been fighting since dawn to liberate our fellow androids from the camps. We won't cease hostilities until we are free and negotiations begin to grant us equal rights. There are millions of us, and we will stop at nothing. I think I've pretty much screwed public opinion. You don't know that.
Yo, what's up, Christy? Ninety percent positive. I can still keep him alive. I think. Is it? Oh, I thought my fucking smoke alarms are going off in the house. I was like, oh fuck. He's gonna pull out a big ass fucking rifle. What do you want, a fucking minigun? <laughs> Hey, you'll give me two seconds. I gotta restart my kid's movie. Alright, see what that is my business. It's not a man. <laughs> it's a machine. That's what I thought for a long time, but I was wrong. Deviant's blood may be a different color than mine. They're alive. Hmm. I have a mission to accomplish, Hank. It's best if you just stay out of this. Uh. Step away from the ledge. Ooh. Ooh. He's on that shooting Hank. I know what happened to your son, Hank. It wasn't your fault. A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Little Cole had just turned six. Shut up! 
Don't you talk about my son. He needed emergency surgery. But no human was available to do when it. When did he learn so an that? an android had to take care of him. Poor Cole didn't make it. An android killed your son, Hank, and now you want to save them? No. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. All this time I blamed androids for what happened, but it was the human's fault. Him and this fucked up world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. Every time you died and came back, I thought about Cole. I'd have done anything to bring him back too, to hold him in my arms just one more time. The humans don't come back, do they? I'm not gonna attack him. Die, robot. Push him off. Push him off. Moment of truth, Hank. Push him off. My living being? We're just a machine. I'd be alright. Still come back. We've arrived, Dallas. We made it. I told you they'd fucking make it. Whether they get on the bus, I don't know, but. Who was I supposed to meet? Did he have the tickets? Oh, I might have fucked up there. Oh, shit. Please don't move. Oh, stay away from them. What am I supposed to be doing? Find tickets. Alright, who has tickets? What is the deal with these magazines? Check. 
Okay, I think I just got him stuck. I literally just got her stuck on a wall. RK900. What did they say about children? Fuck it, like I literally just got them stuck on a wall. That's it. Got the sandwiches. I called your mom. Let's get going before we miss our bus. You got the tickets, right? Yes, honey, in my bag. Great. Well, let's go then. Oh my god, I am so sorry. I, I was sure. Shit, I, I don't believe it. I don't know what happened. You can't have lost them. Did you have a good look in your bag? They were in my backpack. The envelope must have fallen. Fuck. Excuse me, you, you didn't happen to see a blue envelope somewhere, did you? It has our bus tickets in it and... Got my tickets. What are we gonna do? We can't stay here. We have to find a safe place for all of her. I'm, so I'm keeping sorry, them. Honey, come on, I don't know what happened. They were right here in my bag. We need to run out of cover. cover. <laughs> like, what the fuck? your tickets? Yes, here they are. Okay, go ahead. No, okay. What's going to happen to that family and their baby? I'm going to nuke they them. Of us? Absolutely. We need to make a choice, Alice. It was them or us? Oh my God! There's a ghost. How would how would he be a ghost? Somehow he keeps going to that place in his mind. Or and the situation is escalating towards civil war in Detroit, with our armed forces preparing to put down the android rebellion. They seem to be headed towards the camps where the androids have been in turns pending destruction. Soldiers have taken up positions around the Hart Plaza camp. Authorities seem to be expecting a confrontation with the rebel androids here at any time. Free 
regrouped. They outnumber us and they're better armed than we are. We got they regrouped. We just started fighting. We We're gonna do this. We're gonna get to that fucking camp and free our people. Be careful, Marcus. Our people need you. Oh, I'm like Connor's a ghost. We went through a wall. make you run up to that line. I haven't had any glitches so far, except for that one where I just couldn't move. Cover me. Should stay there. Cover me. Am I just getting everyone killed from them covering fire? <laughs> like I said, later.
Uh. In position. On my signal. Alright, well, how do I send it? In position. For Jericho! Stand by. Stand by. Stand by. Was he not gonna shoot or? Watch us! It's over! We have to get out of here right now! Go and pull out that dirty bone. Let's, let's pull it out. Really? You went under the world? Would you play it right when it first came out? I remember, what was it, the other day when I loaded the game? There was a pretty decent sized patch Excuse for me, it. what's going on? Border control. All passengers must leave the bus. Please move along. <laughs> And he's the leader, man. The leader's got to stay alive. Someone's got to lead. This way, please. Do I seriously just wait in line? Yeah, that's probably why. Yeah, I'm sure this was a buggy mess when it first came out. Sick. She's probably end up. That's fine. Quiet. We're doing temperature checks. We're trapped. What are we gonna do, Clara? Oh man, I just killed her. Don't worry, Alice. We'll be fine. Can't I live there? Android! No, wait, wait, wait! This has got to be a mistake! Please! No, no! Oh no, I, I just kept her, I kept her alive because she's going to be warm. Is dead though. That's fine. Go ahead. Next, please. Hey. 
What'd you say? She was Oracle number one? Alright, what am I supposed to do? Find a discreet place. Well, how am I supposed to, like, it won't let me move. Where the hell do you think you're going? My daughter needs to go to the bathroom. Yeah, Cara's dead for sure. She's ended up sending uh, the little girl with Rose. Or she could dump hot water all over herself. Where's the fun in that? So glad you're safe. We saw the Jericho raid on TV. I was terrified. I thought I'm gonna be a great leader killed. when I nuke the city. God, no, right. Uh. You gave me your brother's address. Do you think that I? Of course. He'd be delighted to have you. We're going there too. You'll be safe with him. Her ass bigger than my shelf. Rose. If anything should happen, I'll be there, Cobra. You're leaving Detroit? They're searching for androids door to door. We had to leave before someone turned us in. And what about the others? They're crossing the river as we speak. I thought Adam she was about to say she's an android. Side. What's happening with Marcus? He's attacking one of the android camps as we speak. I don't know if he'll be successful, but violence only leads to violence. They're checking for androids. We won't make it through. You have to. You know what they'll do if they catch you. So I'm telling you, well, she can just get a hair wet or something. Soak her shirt in hot water. That's not an option. <laughs> Get her at 50. I couldn't understand why my mother wanted to help you guys. It made me realize she was right. I don't agree with what Marcus is doing. But you're alive. You deserve to be free. I just hope people will realize that one.
Did I miss something? Make a decision. I knew she'd fuck up that promise. But things didn't turn out like that. Please, please don't leave me. There's no other way, Alex. Listen, I... I want you to go with Rose. She'll give you the life I never could. Here's your passport. You're the best thing that ever happened to me, Alex. You make me feel alive. And you deserve so much more than I could ever give you. I hope you'll find a real family. <laughs> How are you gonna leave a kid that doesn't know she's a robot? Without me. This car is about to get blasted in the head. Yeah, I think this is the end of the road. ID? Here it goes. Here. <laughs> I bet you there's no one telling that girl Friday Night Lights, Ba. Yo, thank you for the follow. Uh, welcome to Canada. He knew. Oh, yeah, he's so nice. God, you got a big eyes. Our 
people have been slaughtered. Go ahead. Take my life. Won't change anything. My mission is to neutralize the leader of the Deviants. And I always accomplish my mission. We fought for a dream and we lost. But nobody can stem the tide of history. <laughs> One day bee. we will prevail. Told you he'd be back. Thousands of our people died today. What difference does one more make? Fuck Amanda. Just being an explosion in Detroit. We still do not know what caused it. It felt so good. We have many unconfirmed reports, but we have no official news on exactly what it is at this time. Explosion in the south of Detroit. We still don't know if there are any victims, but these events may be linked to the Android Rebellion currently taking place in it's the city. Sorry, Hillary. Bomb, Madam President. My God. And the authorities have ordered the immediate evacuation of the city. If it really is a dirty bomb, then the radiation levels will be lethal for miles around. Detroit. Detroit has just fallen into the hands of the Android Rebellion. This is a disaster. An unprecedented disaster. Today, deviant androids triggered a dirty bomb in Detroit. This bomb released fatal levels of radioactive toxic she never change waste. her clothes? To ensure the safety of the population, the military is evacuating all civilians within a 50-mile radius. The city may remain uninhabitable for decades. This is the first time in our history that one of our cities has fallen into enemy hands. We are going to fight them with all our strength, and we won't rest until she don't we have bathe. taken back control of Detroit <laughs> and destroyed the last of them. Humanity is about to face its most important battle, one that will lead to our victory or our extinction. May God bless you all, and may God bless the United States of America. We made it, Alice. Wouldn't be surprised. You're safe now. Jeez, be careful with that ass eats her. Is that the game? Well, I guess so. That was a good game. I like that. The first half was a little flaky. You killed everyone. I killed everybody. You haven't met the douche father, nor the grunt. So you suck. <laughs> 
Hey, my goal, I was supposed to win the rebellion. And I guess I did. I liked it. I'm glad I played it. I wasn't really fond of the ending, though. Just, well, I guess they're safe. I wanted to know... I figured the girl had more of a part of it. Like, she was the cause of it, because she didn't know that she was an android. I don't know. I felt like they could have made her some kind of part of it. Because she has no clue. None whatsoever. I feel like there's a big hole there. Well, I guess that's it. Oh, y'all, thank you for watching. You have. You should have met me. I don't know, I might replay, replay a couple parts tomorrow. I don't know. Really want to get them all? He would have found you, I think. Alright, y'all. That's it for me. Appreciate y'all watching. If you're new to the channel, hit that follow button. Um, I'm probably going to put all these in order and replay them tomorrow. And, uh, later, y'all. Appreciate you.